Hi, y'all. So this is one of the trees that got cold damage. A lot of nice new growth coming along. Buds popping up everywhere. They're all along the branches. This is my fair child. And uh, it's on, a, on its way to a speedy recovery. This is uh, probably my oldest tree, biggest tree that I have right now. My fair child. So this is one of the reasons why I don't like to wait to cut in March because it usually starts regrowing before then. And then if I wait too late, I'm gonna end up cutting off all that growth. And I don't wanna do that. I wanna know where everything is gonna grow so that I can come back in March and trim it to where it needs to get trimmed. And this one here is my Phoenix. So I'm seeing push over here I got push over here I got some push over here not a little green little tip over here um, I got some more pushing going on I can see the little green tips this is just starting to push but this one's on its way to a good recovery as well and let's go visit my cotton candy another one which got killed back okay a lot of new little push coming along here got some push over here still it's just starting to push so I'm not seeing too many I got some on the other side as well I got some there but this one's on its way to a nice speedy recovery and that was my little grafted Phoenix didn't really get damaged from the cold I don't know how we didn't get damaged but this weather is a weird thing here's my peppers so we're walking down to the other side and I'm gonna show you my coconut cream actually was pushing it had another little piece up here with three branches but I didn't like the way it was pushing and I wanted it to push at the ring so I cut it back so I know it's not dead and it should be pushing in a week or two so I'm not worrying about it this is my pineapple pleasure some push going on here pushing on the branches push over here push over here some pushing over here some more pushing over here so this one's looking good. Pineapple pleasure's on its way to a nice recovery. And uh, that's probably it. Maybe little gem. Let me show you little gem. She got damaged. And uh, she's uh, growing back nicely. This is why I don't wait till March. Like everybody says, oh, wait till March to start a tip. And trim now because these things do not wait for March once the weather starts getting warm they're gonna start pushing and I'd rather get it pushing and not just leave all that old wood on there I'd rather push it back trim it back as much as I can all right y'all so just wanted to show you that anybody who has damaged trees you want to just start checking them and uh, Hopefully they'll be pushing out by now. All right, you guys, take it easy. This is Orlando Backyard Gardening. Signing off, y'all. Bye-bye.